Augmented reality is cool, but it can be a little bit complicated. So what we've done is make it a little bit easier to create more dynamic augmented reality experiences because, you know, not everybody has had the experience or the opportunity to learn how to code AR. And if you're a business or a professional or you work with a company that does um, augmented reality, uh, very minor stuff, and you don't want to have to go the whole agency route, this is probably a pretty good tool for you. So we have this built-in customizer and what this does is it gives you a little bit more of a dynamic experience when you are actually experiencing the augmented reality experience on your phone. And I'll show you what all these buttons do, but I just wanted to show you so really quick, this is available for the pro top plan, which is um, our enterprise level. And this feature is found here under customize. So just so you're aware, this API key that we have at the top is going to be pulled in through the content section. Okay, so first things first, I'm going to add a background image. I pulled something off of FreePic, just this generic, beautiful starry night sky. And then we're gonna go ahead and pick audio. Why not? We're gonna tap that so we turn it on. And then I also went to a website called uh, bensound.com. I'll link it in the description. And they have a bunch of free music that you can use. It's royalty free. So I'm going to go ahead and add that. And then for camera capture, sure, we'll turn it on. And you can start to see this is what the preview is looking like. And then over here we have our buttons and logo. So the placement of these is exactly where it's going to show up on your mobile phone. So top left, top center, top right, etc. Although there is a button that will be there um, once the experience is actually on your mobile phone called see in AR. So usually that's where that will go. If you don't see it here in the preview, don't worry. It'll show up once it's on mobile already. So for the top left, why don't we try prompt a message? This is going to be a button that shows up. So we'll just have it say, click me and then enjoy the stars. And then for this one, why don't we do show a logo? I already uploaded our image to postimages.org, so I have the link already. And then we can have it uh, go to our website. And over here, this is a really cool feature. This gives you metrics. This lets you know who's clicking on what, so you're able to track that. And here in our preview, you can see the click me button. And oh, it came out here too, which is nice and then the logo at the top, and then this is going to redirect in the actual AR experience, and um, the C in AR button is here. You just don't see it because you're not on mobile yet, so just keep in mind that that will be there unless you specifically have it moved to another. So I'm gonna go ahead and scan this with my phone, and I'll show you what the result is. It's worth mentioning that the background image works only in the AR preview, not in the actual 3D experience because you want to be able to see everything around you. So this would be a really good application for retail, for example.